No, it's a special feeling for me. It's a new chapter. You know, I've been at, I was at Chelsea for 20 years of my life. This is a special time for me to, to finally break away from the club, start a new chapter in my life. And for it to be at AC Milan is, is incredible. To have the opportunity to play here at San Siro, this huge club with the history it has, the legends that have played for the club. It's, a, it's an honor to, uh, to put the shirt on. Especially when um, Fikayo Tomori came here. I think he's a he's a great example of someone to who's tried a new challenge away from England and been very successful. And for him to win, you know, the the title with with Milan uh, and the success he's already had with the club, it's just inspired me to come here as well. Uh, and I've played with Fikar in the academy, and, and it'd be good to to wear the same shirt as him uh, in the San Siro. I've spoken to him a lot over the past month couple of months even especially when you know things came out in the press and he was asking me if I was coming at times I couldn't say too much to him but you know when things started getting serious I started asking him about the club just normal stuff where where he lives where the players where the players live where the training ground is just just questions like that and you now he said if you come and you'll feel how big the club is and the, and the history of the club and what it means to play for AC Milan and I, and I was always always tempted to come. I mean, when we played AC Milan in the Champions League and I felt what it was like to play in the San Siro, even though we were, we were against AC Milan, you could feel the atmosphere in the stadium was just amazing. I love to watch Kaka play purely because he was just an incredible runner with the ball. And that's one of my strengths in the, in the game is, you know, when I can when I can open up and run with the ball and uh, Kaka was one of the best at that. So Kaka was definitely one of my one of my favourites to watch. We shook hands at the end of a game a couple of times, but the level he's he's producing at the moment is is top world class and he can only go on to, to get even better and better. And he looks like he has the attitude to do that. And he, he messaged me. Um, a couple of weeks back as well. So it'd be good to, to you know, properly meet, meet him and um, share the pitch with him. I'm accustomed to a lot of positions um, in my career. Different formations, you know, required me to play different positions and I've been comfortable with that. But I feel like my best is, you know, where, where I can impact a game the most is in, in the midfield, in a box-to-box -box position where I can get up and and score goals and, and get back and defend and bring my physicality and that's what I really want to do uh, in this league. Premier League is very intense, very physical. From what I've seen in the Serie A, it looks very, a lot of tactics, a lot of chess, but I'll have to see uh, and actually feel what it's like to play in the games. Like you said, I've had, had Italian coaches who are very tactical tacticians. That's my experience with, with Italian coaches. I'm a pretty relaxed character. Um, Easy, easy going, passionate. You know, outside the football, I like to, to relax with friends. I play a lot of tennis in my in my spare time. That's a that's a hobby of mine. So yeah, I like to stay active when I can. Just love playing football, and and that's it. Hi guys, um, I'm honoured to be at this club. I can't wait to put the shirt on and, and play my first game in front of you. All. Thank you for the support that I've been getting already. And yeah, like I said, can't wait to see you all soon.